Greetings and salutations, I'm Kem. Welcome back to this Let's Play of XCOM UFO Defense. Or UFO Enemy Unknown. <laughs> Don't worry, we were just Zy attacked. Poor Mikhail here. He has a psionic strength of 77, so he certainly resisted that. That's good news. Uh, you know what, let's have a quick look here. Just to verify that there aren't someone hiding on that side. Uh, doesn't seem to be. And Neil there. You should still have time for a snapshot. Yes, perfect. And the rest of you are just going to go up there. We don't have the blaster launchers and we don't have the Siam, so we kind of have to hoof it. Hoof it all the way up to the upper floors and kill these aliens. These aliens, these aliens. Uh, one of them was hiding here and he fled up the corridor. And we can actually see him there. Oh! He's down there. Um. Kill. No! No! Okay, he missed quite a bit. Still have time for a snapshot. Come on. Kill him. Much better. Oh, you made me nervous there. Dreyfus, don't make me nervous. So we know there's an alien out upstairs. Uh, you kneel, hopefully you'll have some reaction fire. We don't have enough time to actually crawl up the lift, so... That's why we're doing that. We might need another save. We might need backup. It's gonna be you. So let's see. That's one, two, three dead aliens inside the craft so far. So that's seven dead aliens. Uh, just go into the trees, would you please? Yeah, definitely no one here. So we can just go towards the UFO now. Running out of energy, huh? Wait. Oh, okay, so the uh, level thing doesn't actually auto-adjust when you move your soldiers up and down in level. Ah, that kind of explains why I had some issues earlier in understanding how this works. Uh, da -da -da. You have almost no hit points, you're gonna be dead. Let's up. Right. Now watch them all see an alien just hover down there and not shoot. What do you mean we're supposed to shoot the aliens? Okay, we didn't die. That's... <laughs> Always a good turn when you don't, when you don't die. Uh, I think I want to breach with Dreyfus. Okay, so that alien moved away from the corridor. Make a smaller target, please, and wait there. That agent is undoubtedly waiting for us. So... We'll make sure... Again, it would only take one blasted launcher to cause us some significant pain. Go over there. Uh, we need to 
start with the front unit here. Uh, there could be more lurking down there, I suppose. Don't see anyone. Um, yeah, let's position there. Let's group up a few troops before we actually mark up. Especially since we have so many rookies around here. Miss Akira! Okay, there. You're probably gonna use your hover. Alright, oh, we shot a <laughs> we shot a hole in the hedge there earlier. Okay, Petrov, you're gonna go in there. You haven't been psi attacked. Oddly enough. Lester, uh yeah, head this way please. Should be running out of energy, energy soon. Miss Taylor can head there. And Akira, in you go. Okay, that's gonna be it. Only a sliding door, nothing more. So, we know there's one alien hiding on this level. No idea where, though. Uh, you're a psychic, though, so I don't really want to use you. I kind of have to, you're all psychics now. Not there, not there. Well, there he is. I see you, bastard. Sadly, there's not much I can do. Neil. Uh-oh. Stop, stop, shoot, don't kill me. He survived. That's good, at least. So, return the favor. Our turn to auto shoot. Are you kidding me? He shot at us. Are you telling me I don't have a line of fire because I'm kneeling? Okay, so you can't actually hit me from there. That's what you're saying. Um, okay, Grigory. Oh, shots. There wasn't, had to be another one. Uh, fire, 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 fire. Okay, oh, there's another one. No, he's gonna react fire. And kill us. Okay, not kill us, but down. Close enough. Um, you could have snapshot and die. Run away. Run away, I say. Can you shoot from there? Oh, perfect. Um, can you go there? You could. Can you shoot from here? Oh, I feel much better now. Uh, as long as there aren't any aliens hiding on that side. What, three of them? So we killed all three. That means the body count is up to ten, I think. And you're gonna go and just make sure nobody's hiding around here. Not that it would help to know at this point. We can't do anything about it. Three dead aliens here. I don't think there's gonna be all that many more. But you never know. Okay, Miss Taylor, approach. Uh, da, 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 da. Right, there was this side of the UFO too. Go up, please. And this is just an intermediate level with no doors or anything, right? Yeah. So, onwards. And I know there's a door there. Nobody's hiding nearby. Okay. 
go and hide in the corner. Yeah, so I think the bodyguard is a 10. Um, but there are at least two psychic aliens on top side. And probably more. But I think we must have killed the blaster launcher alien already. Because the soldiers are usually outside. Inside the craft is usually just the command staff, so... There, Mr. The Cider. Yeah, head up there just in case they need backup. And you just hold there. And Lester, you know what? You just hold right there. No, oh, there was a fair bit of movement. There might still be quite a few aliens left. Okay, Mikael, you have had luck so far. Come on. Breach the craft. Have a look. No one there. Don't move too far. I want to verify that nobody's hiding in this corner either. Okay. Um... Rudy's gonna help breach this door. You are gonna go forwards. If you can. And hang around there, that's fine. You stop there. Crystal, you go here. Ah, face the door please, there we go. And then there's all of you guys. If there had been more aliens down here, they would probably have uh, shown up and shot at me by now. Probably. Stay right there. Cider, you're gonna run outside. Stand right there. Um, you go on the other side of the door. Don't see anyone? No, I don't seem to be anyone there. Of course, there is this door over there. Which you are going to open next turn. And you guys aren't going to do anything. You're going to wait, you're going to wait. Sure, you're gonna you can join. In you go, Miss Akira. Go, go, Makaro. You can go alongside there. Because that should be the fastest path to the command deck. Things fine. We just need to move you out. Don't remember if there's a lift there. I don't think there is. Okay. Oh, he's there. Shoot him, shoot him. Are you kidding me? Finally, someone did a reaction fire. Oh my. Oh, and here comes the side attacks. Two of them. Did either take. No, not no effect on this guy. And uh, no effect on Miss Akira either. Uh, 65, so she's weaker. And this guy is 64. At any rate, we know there is an alien up here. Um, 
I need to use you, don't I? There, you should see him. I need to kill him right away, so we have to go with auto shot. Pesky little guy. Very much doubt there are anyone in here, but just a quick verification of that. And again, I doubted there were anyone left on this floor. And that was incorrect. So I think the body count is now at 11. I very much doubt there's anyone in here now. Because he would have run out and killed us. I've never actually experienced if the alien uh, that the aliens run and hide somewhere, if you know what I mean. Don't think I've seen that. It's certainly not that they would be, yeah, holed up in a little corner of the map like that. With perhaps the sole exception of those snake men that hid in the hay balls ages ago. Yeah, I'm not bitter. Not at all. Uh, Peach. What could possibly go wrong? Uh, anyone there? No. Anyone there? No. Okay. Advance to next door. Let's see now. They are very likely hiding right around that corner. Um, let me go there. And kneel and wait right there. I want all the troops to be there before you do anything. There could be one more hiding down here, but I think it would have. I think we would have noticed him. Oops, that was one square too many. I hope there aren't anyone nearby. No, it seems to be fine. Okay. Oh no no no! Stop Sai attacking me. Luckily, our soldiers are now far more able to defend against that kind of bull, so there's that. Uh, you're gonna go there. And I knew you'd find someone. Kill. Mm, stay put right there, please. There's almost certainly one more inside that craft, but um, you know what? Guard this corner. And you just hide behind there. And there's you guys. Need to cover the escape. Ah, turn. Turn, you bastard. There we go. We won't go that far. Huh? Go here, then. There we go. And then you can go there, please. And turn. Perfect. Okay, I think we're in the clear on this level now. 
So we'll just see to see if we can get that last one or two. Oh, stop commanding. Uh, yeah. And they're very quick to do that simply because they know we're about to kill them. Because they're both in here. There must be two. No. Oh, there you are. Kaboom. Wow, he actually took two shots in the face. Um, Study little sectoid. Okay, and that's that. Was that the last one? That could actually be the case. I would have thought this craft would have 16 aliens, but I think that's the 12th we've killed. Unless someone's hiding down here, I don't think that's likely. Because there are usually two command aliens up here, and then there are a whole bunch on the center floor. It certainly looks, and the craft certainly starts to look empty now. Yeah, I think that actually was the last one. It's only 12 aliens on this one. But most important of all, intact engines. Illyrium! We wants, we needs. Thirteen aliens, okay. Thirteen dead, thirteen corpses, sixteen artifacts, three power sources, navigation, but 150 Illyrium alloys. Yes! Illyrium 115. Excellent. Excellent indeed. That is very, very juicy indeed. We need that fuel. We desperately need that fuel. That was very nice to get. Um, and I think we're gonna do some cell sacking right away because all this loots, we don't need it. We actually had no casualties either, which is even better. I'm not selling any of the plasma clips. We might just need them. And it's nice to have a little, yeah. Uh, piggy bank <laughs> in case we really need to sell stuff at least we have that available to us another bunch of corpses um, sell one of the navigation units at least how many more craft are we gonna build we're gonna build firestorms at all the bases. We probably want a couple of Avengers too. We're gonna keep the power sources for now. Food on the other hand. Not as important. We're gonna keep one for research. Same with surgery. Uh, we can sell like, above 300 at the very least we can sell. I think. So I'll sack that because we are immediately gonna start uh, dismantling the small radar system. Yeah, we have the hyperwave here, so we can do that. And we're gonna build a psionic slab right there. And we're gonna build a second psionic slab, like so. And we probably want to transfer troops over there afterwards. And let's see, both of you have the hyperwave decoder under production, excellent. We were setting up Claymore to be a secondary research facility. Uh, I suppose I could do that too. Um, here we were gonna dismantle these in favor of base defenses. Let's see, it's safe to do that, right? Yeah. Base will still hold together. Um, not purchase recruit, build facilities. Gonna build the grab shield and then the laser defenses. Start with that. I suppose we could tear down the living quarters for a missile defense too, actually. Right, we have the uh, capacity for that. Yeah. An extra 150 living quarters. So we can easily do that. 
Okay, let's do that. So we have at least some defenses coming up. Um, the other thing we wanted to move would be the labs. Oh, sorry about that. That of course can't happen until these are finished. That's gonna be a month anyway. And if we're gonna do that, we need to build more stuffs on Claymore. Let's see. You have no living stuff here. Uh, you have 150 living quarters. So you don't need more than that. You need another... You're going to need one more lab. And you're going to need... Actually an alien containment. Yeah, you're going to need that because we're going to have to interrogate aliens and stuff. Um, and I can't tear down either of the radar stations yet, because otherwise if you do that we won't have connections. So that is fine. I could engineer the outback into one of those. Hmm. Yeah, I could set this one up to be uh, a um, another manufacturing base, and I might in time. But for now, let's get all the defensive structures going instead. I want to do that here too, right? Yeah. Not running out of money though. Get the missile defense at the very least. There, so we can start building down this road. Road. This road. Let's see. Cell sack. Yeah, maybe I should get rid of a few of the spare thingy bobs here. Maybe not yet. Let's see now. Um, small launchers, we actually have quite a few of those um, already. Don't need many more of those. I don't need that many stun bombs. Let's keep 10. And sell another 100 of the alien alloys. Because when are the manufacturing going to end? That's going to be in two days. Yeah. Then we have to hire more engineers and get that online. And then base defenses. Yeah, but the most crucial thing we needed right now was the Psylabs. So that we can transfer 20 soldiers there. And have a full complement of soldiers here. And we're gonna start washing out soldiers to these other bases as they come online. I want 20 soldiers with probably personal armor and laser rifles as guard stuff. Uh, right, we had one rookie that we needed to train, that's correct. One we had to replace. It's just completed. Blasted launcher. Mm. Lovely. Now we can research fusion missiles. Uh, come to think of it. Did we research? There's a go. Plasma defenses. We can have the technology for it. But I'm gonna go with the fusion missiles first. Now I can make blaster launchers, blaster lumps, hover tanks with blasters. Yeah. All the fun toys. Uh, but Siamps have to come first. We just have to finish the laser cannons. Speaking of. Oh, we got it short. Uh, actually, you stopped production because we didn't have funds. Okay. Um, you know what? Sell some excess alloys. So I am going to need some Siamps. 
which are gonna require Illyrium. Not much though. Um, how many of them am I gonna need? Six? Let's start with six. Yeah, do that and we're gonna continue with our uh, manufacturing program. I think. Okay, so at least the uh, engineers won't bankrupt you. They won't build you into bankruptcy. Hey, research completed. Floater autopsy. This creature has been drastically altered by surgery. The device which seems to form the core of the body is a life support system, taking over the function of the heart, lungs and digestive system. This would enable the creature to survive in extremely hostile environments. The brain is smaller than ours, but the sensory organs are well developed. So now let's interrogate a live one. Uh, we should have a floater medic. Kind of a waste. Medics would give us an autopsy report, I think. If we already had them uh, pegged. Oh, no matter. So, UFOs. It has been a few days. Where, where's your focusing area this month? Well, that's the only UFO we see in the Central Asian one, and we kind of blew that out of the sky. Both of them. Maybe you haven't sent any more. Of course, we've been active. Certainly in the US, and also in Central Asia. Did we take down a UFO within China? Thought we did. Doesn't seem to register there. It's okay though, we still have a positive score. So things aren't going that badly. But for now, I think we need another short break. Been playing for a while. Thank you for watching.